Option premium. It's a term that's constantly thrown around and for option newbies, it can be a major headache trying to comprehend it. In its most simple definition, an option premium is nothing more than the current market price of an option contract. Thus, by this definition, the premium is the income received by the seller, aka the writer of an options contract, to another party. But like all things options, things get more and more complicated as you dig further and further. Let's start with some basics. The first thing you need to understand about options pricing is that it's extremely complex. This video is intended to break it down into a more simple format, helping you evaluate pricing in a more clear manner. Think of it like taking an algebra-based physics class instead of a calc-based one. Same concepts, just simplified. The price of an option is the work of a mathematical miracle that can be broken down into three distinct important parts. Intrinsic value, time value, and implied volatility. Those three parts combined make up the option price. We start with time value. If you understand the basic premise of options, you will know that they have an expiration date. The time value portion of an options price is heavily associated with this expiration date. As we approach expiration, time value moves towards zero. This just means that the contracts with expiration dates well into the future will be more expensive than those expiring soon. Think about it this way. If you're betting the Steelers will win the Super Bowl this year, that bet has a much lower chance of winning than someone betting the Steelers will win the Super Bowl this century. The time value is high on the second bet, while it's low on the first. Option contracts with more time to come to fruition will have higher time values. This is why when you look at options pricing, those further dated ones will appear to be more expensive. Now we move on to intrinsic value. Remember that an option also has a strike price. How far away the underlying security is from the specified strike price determines its intrinsic value. As an option becomes further in the money, the option's premium normally increases. The further out of the money it becomes, the further the price decreases. Some options that are out of the money will have no intrinsic value, meaning that their price is almost entirely determined by their time value and implied volatility. Going back to football, this will be like betting the Steelers to win the Super Bowl at the beginning of the season versus betting them to win the Super Bowl after they had already won the semifinal. One bet has high intrinsic value because the chances of it finishing in the money are also high. This is why options deep in the money are much more expensive than those out of the money because their chances of finishing in the money is also relatively high. You can tell what those chances are by peeking at the delta value which is essentially a measurement of how likely it will be that you will end up in the money at the date of expiration. Last, we have the final piece to an options price, implied volatility. This portion is described as the volatility of the underlying stock. The greater the implied volatility, the more expensive the option. This is because once again, the chances of finishing in the money are significantly higher if the stock is experiencing rapid ups and downs. This is also why you will see implied volatility usually increase right before something like an earnings call. The market is anticipating large ups and downs and the options price will reflect that. For an example, it's known that Tesla stock moves heavily following a bad or good report. You may think that buying call or put options right before earnings is a sure way to make a lot of money, but as you would assume, nothing is that easy. The market already anticipates movement so options prices will reflect that via implied volatility. In order to make money on an earnings play like that, you would need a significant enough pricing move to beat or exceed the market anticipation. When you combine these three factors, you get a total price known as the option premium. To be fair, this video is only intended as an introduction and each of these concepts examined are much more complex than what this video would have you believe. If you dig deeper, you will discover the murky deep waters of options pricing filled with terms like Black Skulls, the Greeks, Ivy Crush, and much, much more. Although football analogies can serve to help guide you in the right direction, they can only do so much as scratch the surface. The world of options is highly complex, and derivatives trading is a never-ending pit of concepts and equations that will leave you speechless. Anybody who is trading options is learning something new every single day. 
Thank you guys for watching. If any of you guys are planning on betting on a different type of market this week, something like NFL sports betting, please consider supporting this channel by signing up for one of the most reliable online sports books in the world, Bavada. Please use the affiliate link below and enjoy a 100% bonus on whatever amount you first deposit.